Hi, my name is Abdul Lami. I grew up in Middle East, Iraq. I used to live in Baghdad, in a small city. I used to live with my family, which included two sisters and one brother, and my mom and my, and my dad. One of my sisters was a college student, and the, others, one, and the other one a high school student, and my oldest brother was a college student. Life back there was not really bad. I used to go to school for just like a normal life. And after school, I used to go to the soccer field to practice soccer with my friends. We also used to, to have a champions against each other. Teams and winners would get teams and winner would get a reward. I left from Iraq in April 28, 2016. My main goal when I left Iraq was to get a better education and to have more opportunities for myself and my families. Little, little did I know that education to have more opportunities for myself and my family. I would have to face a great challenges and, and hardships. For example, language barrier learning a new culture and most of all racism i left i felt racism at public places and even in me in my school my father was a superstar in soccer in iraq but here he just uh, another person who's facing with all of these challenges i brought i brought i brought all of my immediate family members with me I also brought my culture, tradi traditions, and an Arabic language with me. I also brought dreams for a better life. What I left behind, what I left behind me, was my dear friends, and most of my and most of my extended fr family, friends, all the all the ones I used to hang out with, for 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 our fun together, and I miss them the most. Another thing that I miss the most is Azima. In Iraq, we used to, we used to have Azima in the traditions, in a tradition, in which we get invited together, like like the whole family and siblings. There was a different kind of food, and even the meal that we had together. And now, after spending three years in America, life has become be has become a little easy. Life is easy because the language is not that big of a deal anymore. And I have also learned the new culture. However, some of others' great challenges still exist, like race or like racism, discrimination. But, I, but, I, but I'm happy because I'm a student at the, at the high school and I already have my dream job and I'm wonderful for the future. I'm, hope, I'm sorry, I'm hopeful for my future.